<laughs> ah, okay. I took a bad fall. So this is my fall diary. I was riding my 10 speed and I fell. I never fall riding my bike. It was just so stupid. I was I had just left the house. I wasn't even hardly on the bike before this even happened, but yeah, I uh, was going down a parking lot in a school, down the sidewalk of the school, passing all the classrooms, came back around, and I usually go down this one. It's a little nook of in between a curb stop and a curb going back into the parking lot, and I didn't make it, and it's like about this wide, wide enough for my wheels to go through, as long as my pedals are like parallel with each other they weren't i was going too fast i had one pedal down i'm pretty sure that's what happened and it clipped and it hit the curb stop i flew off the bike uh, the bike twisted i wish i could like relive it in slow motion so i could see like exactly what happened along the way but i don't remember because it happened too fast yeah then i landed on my knee and it just took a big gash out of my knee, so big that I had to put two band-aids together just to cover the area. That's how big the gash it was. And I scraped my thigh. I got like a bruise there too. So I must have hit the handlebars. I don't know. I'm not really sure what happened. But uh, this motivated me to make a top five list of my top five horrible falls. <laughs> Number one is when I broke my arm riding down a hill on a caster board. The front wheel turned or got stuck or I'm not sure how that happened either but I was going down this hill. I lost it. I flew, landed on my, my palms, and slid, scraped up all of my uh, hip scraped up my face like all this part was just all gone and I broke my arm from the impact of hitting so hard I guess combined with my age because I'm, I'm old so the bone just shattered and broke cut clean it was a uh, good times and I have footage of the aftermath I just have never put it together I've never edited it and I should so maybe now I will. That was number one. Uh, number three, longboard skating against the wind in a parking lot. <laughs> the wind was hitting one way, I suddenly turned another way. I was expecting the wind to hit me, so I kicked harder to break the wind, but there was no wind. So I threw me off, I lost my footing, I flew off. The board went one way, I flew the other way and I landed all on my chin. So I got all scraped here. Had to go to work the next day. I have awesome makeup. No one ever noticed. That was number three. Number four. When I was walking to my mom's house, I was walking. I wasn't on anything, I was walking. The sidewalk I was walking on was pushed up so far from like a tree, the roots had pulled it up and I never walked that way, so. I wasn't aware. I just wasn't looking down. I don't know what I was looking at. And I missed that step. I just missed like the, the huge drop. I fell forward. <laughs> and it looked like I fell on my face, but I didn't, I didn't fall on my face. I uh, ripped up my knees, both of them, pretty bad. And it was super gravelly, muddy. I had all that junk in there and I had to like wash all that stuff off. So, yeah, that was just embarrassing. Number five. I think number five was uh, when I was trying to uh, close my gate. I rode my soul skate to the gate and I didn't, I don't know what happened. I got stuck, something stopped me and I just flew forward, straight on the gate. Like I hit the gate, I kind of like hit it and I think I hit my lip. I remember hitting something here. Um, now I don't remember, but I did land down on my knee again, so I, yeah, scraped my knee again. My knees are so scarred up, dude, like you don't even know. Like it's just because most of the 
the falls, all the impact always just happens on the knees. And especially when I'm skating, I've been known to fall just walking. Like it's just something that always happens. I'm always falling and I'm falling on my knees. They are super scarred up. If, if anything that I have to say to you, listen to this, okay? Just pay attention. No matter what you do, never let yourself be afraid to fall.